Hello my wonderful subscribers. This is Active TV again for another update. Please subscribe to the channel if you are not yet subscribed and please do not forget to turn on the notification bell. Mbadi ngolo Active TV le natale nan kwata ke pour kana kudo fanan jube. Al kana nyana ali subscribe channel to ning atral ma subscribe ali notification bell to click pour ning video nata wato wati. Al sa jeno nyameng al kana nyana al blano ma Instagram acctive.tv. I am also on Facebook, ACTIVE Space TV. Please do not forget to follow me on Instagram, ACTIVE.TV. I am also on Facebook, ACTIVE Space TV. Mina Shaitan Rajim. Bismillah Rahman Rahim. Alhamdulillah, Rabbil Alameen. Alhamdulillah, was salat, was salamu. على رسول الله صلى الله تعالى عليه وسلم كو جيت يومي تشا كو فيلو غامبيانس السلام عليكم ورحمة الله تعالى وبركاته مبي مول بي كونتونا أم Mbal beten tu la mbal jaila, mbe dua la fana, na banko aning banku tomal be, kurang be dau da, mbe dua la forman satu la se nyok nyokol nying, ala se ibe ulen di kairola. Kila ni mahormor, sallallahu sallam. Omar, Omar, ta momia, ta momia. Go, go to mommy, go. I'm talking. Go. Na time ta even though sometimes it 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 it's very boring to you know have to listen to a video that is so long and all of that but i took my time today <clears throat> um to watch um the program that uh fatu ture conducted on her platform today um inviting lawyer usenu dabo to discuss a host of issues um notable among them the april 14 and 16 you know uh, uh, situation but uh, before i got into that you know i just want to make one thing clear um when i posted this post um a lot of people wrote to me within a short period of time to tell me you cannot have to do that you know this is politics and this is life um we have to be very realistic there is nothing wrong in people discussing about what people say in politics there is nothing wrong when somebody misrepresented realities to come and get the factual the true version of the matter there's nothing wrong about that you know this mentality that somebody can say all that he or she wants but the other person cannot is is what is taking us back as a country and as a society especially in 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 africa when an elderly or a respectful a respectable man like usenu dabo comes out to the world and says things that he knew are far away from what really happened it is you know obligatory open those that knew the facts to tell the people hmm, i do not know whether dabo forgets or he is deliberately misrepresenting the truth this is exactly what happened as opposed to what he says Follow, 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 follow. Mbe fatu tu reten tu la mba jaila. Nga kumandile, nga eko. 
there are things that you left out i was not happy but in general the interview was fantastic it was about a lot of issues that are going on in the country number one was about you know sirifo songo i am not going to delve into that much because there are a lot of things happening you know officially and with iec that is law i have no business with that but then when it comes to the matter of government reaching out to oppositions because ya nyinin kale kai ko nin ayatuma ko nyimu udp government netinung albe munekela ko he will reach out to people he will reach out to people aning opposition leader le kachai be ko kala nyadile but he saying his Excellency President Adam Abaro made a statement. In that statement, President Adam Abaro reached out to every good citizen. This is a national issue. Why can't all of us come together? President Adam Abaro invited all and sundry, all stakeholders in the country to come together and work as a team and help in the fight against this virus. President Adam Abaro made that general invitation. He made that general invitation. Is Usenu not a stakeholder? Dabo is a stakeholder. Why didn't he respond? But his response was that was not a serious call. How does a serious call look like when a president stands before the nation? Nimmanza tambida banko nyato alota ko banku dingol be albet dao da lafta be kafunyoma nga nyinkele nyimanke politiki kuti nga albe bisimla e pura albe na nga kafunyoma nga doku ke nga keloke kanyin kurang kelendi iteko manke serious kumandirt. Mansanyanta la reach out because protocol will be jele, ye reach out to bar sign. Al nga fok, okay, mansamang reach out. Nite Gambia Banko kanu, adi lafta Gambia la Banko mi alon kom bele tam, ite talo mo bele tam adung, ite be o Banko kan, nite la alfa ya be nyame, ni la dimbaya alfana al bele be o Banko kan, amanke ite ni dingol damati, ite wuluta o Banko le kan, ila bari muso ol bije, ni dingol ui bari nke ol bije, la nefi ol bije, mo jama ba, Ita la bading lakra bolbe o banko ka. Nim mansa man fude ite ma. Fwede te fuda nalo mansa ma. You were a vice president. Why didn't you reach out to that protocol? Because here o protocol o lone. You know alaji sise. You know where to get all of these people. Why can't you as a stakeholder, as a leader of a political party, reach out to a protocol ka hafaya ko hmm. Nga mwele de presidene di amoke. Hanna tu ma mandol kumandi. We want to reach out puru. Nga itanda ala ko. Nyimu banku be kuol di politiko nde nyindi. Nyanta ndol selo dula jumale keno nate. Purunga doku ke bankwe. Dabo could have done that. He could have reached out if he is saying ko president's reach out is not a serious reach out. Why can't Dabo reach out? This is about the country as he said. This is not about any politics as he said. This is about the lives of people. This is about the well-being of every citizen including Dabo and his family. If Barrow did not reach out as he said, but to Ross Barrow reached out, he made, a, he made a life statement. That was what Trump did. That was what Boris Johnson did. That was what Prime Minister Justin Trudeau did. They made televised statement. You know, they talk to people, they reach out to oppositions in the media. Those that are interested in the well-being of the country join together. But if that was not enough for Usenu Dabo, the leader of the UDP, and he feels God, this is a concerted effort, why didn't he reach out to Alaji Sise, the protocol that he's talking about, to tell Alaji, hmm, for us, we have at least heard about the president's call, even though it was not directed to us. We want to come and join you. Our president, Yeko. Laftalem Fanalia Kafama, we want to join him. 
aliala respond but nga jibe what's going to happen that is number one but you didn't do that fatu today again ask as to why dabo did not as an opposition if president did it reach out why didn't you lead the oppositions why didn't you all come together he would not answer it because he has not done it but i'm gonna for i could find dolu bije by the dolu dolu man song initiative la juma le man so he didn't say anything about that akop mimbe kera tete o fala why wouldn't you say it bangola problem o ni manke national security treaty ibe television oldo it all after concerted effort la ning ayatuma ko itele be government bari man tra government iko fanang government has not reached out to you but you are an opposition leader you have other opposition parties why didn't you reach out to them to come together and move toward the president or come together and you know i mean i mean work towards uh, 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 helping the situation but no you have to form your own initiative whatever it's called for political reasons and i remembered long time ago that president adama baros baro youth movement for national development baros national youth movement baro youth movement i remembered and i watched dabo on a platform dabo in an interview with a with a with a particular station telling them ko baro media empowerment ka fund min soro wo manya na dila wala because you know i mean there are institutions in yandaka or development program or the minula baro youth movement is a political party ning atuma ko hani baro e fund samba nang it should be given to a government institution a line ministry mi along ko so development okay why is usenu dabo initiating udp a fenko i mean a a a a buntumo food bank why is he we have national disaster management agency national disaster management agency bijele ni problem ol be keri ni serious issue ol nada gambia this is a special institution mi alonko itolel kamol mako ni problem o soto da banko ka nyilel mu fanalti ni dimba disaster kela ni kolu national disaster management agency will go and assess government be assistance min dile adi through this institution this is an established institution through an act of parliament why would usenu dabo go and have a buntungo or food bank for the country when you have an institution an institution that is an act of parliament that government has and you can go through it and 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 and, and then you know i mean help that institution to help the gambians if it is not about politics تأمرون الناس بالبر وتنسون انفسكم وانتم تتلون الكتاب انكم كاني نفواتي واتي نا فيندي داي دي امكو اتلم اي مول كاجا في كولا برنا سيتا دي فانوما اتا بارالا اداي لوالو اتس نيفر غوين تو هيلب ابريل 14 mo jamaaka wala wala bi para 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 alama ale ne manin kafar ke solo sande alama ale ne manin kafar ke lamaro ye alama ale ne manin kafar ke e madi sise national assembly member adingo ye ngamara to mi ibrahima siselti national assembly member for serakunda adino bigé alama ne manin kafar kala e solon kurumay <coughs> follow 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 kila sallallahu alayhi wa sallam muslimo beke ya kamina لقد كان لكم في رسول الله اسوه حسنه كلا صلى الله عليه وسلم يا كرمو ب مسلم ولي ابلا يا كرمو ميالون كا سنياتا باك يا كرمو ايموليشن كلا واز ها 
and has always been a person to emulate. He had a system that all of us had to emulate. Wakila sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Molmi yalonko walel tata. Badri kelola. Foy beletale, foy balutale. Bunya tarte beyele. Horomo tarte beyele. Kalanke atarte beyele. Foy janning al kiyama lulu. Minu fade kumada. Minu baluta ikumada kila koto. April 14, sonko minketa ge. April 14. Aman start nu April 14 dama. Nde Ahmad jite, nde, nde, nde kundingo. Manzata labe sediaring anala kila. Nga kujama kala mutaje. Sedol benna adun sedol sedi ba ala o kafa billahi shahidan bari sedo dol bi jemini alon ko bi e be balurinde banka mane be balurin amamfa banka mane onkul sidi sane nyol bi je hani oje jallo kata lamin tunkara tunkara especially these are people mini alon molia kalamta wato Gaina ko radio, fatu radio. A lot of people mini along ko ebe diaspora. They knew about my involvement in politics. Ala nata ake. Nyin demonstration of political reform. Nga kuja ma balo nje. It's a sensitive issue. Adum be longo ye di bari be fo mandia. Jalba ku ya te olofo eka be long bari buka be fo no. Because ni oketa. A lot of things are compromised. Adun e mansata la yalon kuo dolu bije wolu. Wol katu jele folda bansu bari. Tenengo. That is a day before. O tiri o four days. Janning April 14. Mimu arami soti. Janna kake. Nde Ahmad jite alabe sedi arana la kila. Ning solo sanden dia mutale. Adun aramiso fana nying aramisa lungu fana alka mifoteng. Lumina solo sanden mutata. Ngao fana nkala muta. Bairi wo lungu fana nying solo sanden dia mutale. Nying solo koto ndeka afale koto ke na dia muta. Monde because nying kuo, nying kuo meta kurukuru lalde. Mo jamale da bije minu vederim because ye solo disappoint. Mo jamale be banta jang, especially diaspora. Ye kumal fo solo e mi alonko a manke tonyati. Ye kumal fa e mini alonko tonya kumolunteng. Ye abitre. Ndenga oldo ol kalamda bairim. Mo li ya faile ko ito liye gurupol soto le. Gurupol mini alonko a lot of people ye ole soto. They have a group of people mini alonko they are ready. They can participate. They can help. They can go and push this matter. You know with solo electoral reforms and all of that. Yes monetarily some of them contributed a lot. I don't want to mention names. But this April issue contributions a lot of it came from diaspora. There were some who promise human capital, that is, human beings to be part of the demonstration. I am young, I am poor, but I was highly involved in these matters. Kabirin solo data Dakar because Gambia was not safe. He went to Dakar. Those that were involved from the beginning knew what I am talking about because solo, in fact, was giving a satellite mobile phone. Those people that knew what a satellite phone is. He was giving a satellite phone from the diaspora here. I was aware of everything. Because I was there from the beginning. I was trusted. And Solo was very open about his intention. And we were all very much relying on Solo. But one thing Solo was doing. He was a very smart guy. And very genuine in what he was doing. And because of that, because of that, he will not put his eggs in one basket. 
ba nina ya kacha asa afonye ko hun nga fo kariele asa ke sedot nga fo kariye asa ke sedot nga fo kariye asa ke sedot dole bi jente wol to fo la bi bare ngani e tol fo bi nde ku kilim politiko kono e ba fo le mu wulolti ba lamin tun karobe baluri nede amamfa and he's in the gambia right now When Solo went to Dakar, he collected the satellite telephone. He came with whistles, torolu, anim fotangolu, anim fengola ni nata. We had a lot of discussions because at the time it was not even safe to have those discussions in the Gambia. Again, one of Solo's closest accomplices was my own brother, Buba Jita from Kiti, eh, eh, Gunjur. Buba Munkotolti, Munkotolem. Buba Jita Abota Gunjurle, one in Solo Sanding. They were in this matter from the beginning. Yes, Solo was the contact person from the diaspora. Tenel Lungo, Nin Solo Diamuta, this was in Honorable Usenu Dabo's house in Pipeline. Nga Kumandi Na Diamuta, Nka Kulbenya di Kotoke, Akonya Mbaka Nakonya, in fact, um, a eh, you know, keba ma be bisi dembari dembo by force fell and batunga delay na diamu billahi wallahi tallahi ala be sedi aring dembo by force abe baluring fa bari men bala fa da remember bari dembo by force ka be bisi ne solo telephone da kai ko na din dong lafte e konto na jite after findi tan nay kuma dan dan fo kai ko be kumandilal this was on monday on Tuesday, on Wednesday, on Thursday, in program or sort of yes, Dabo, I solo Sunday Kumandile. I mean for Fatu Radio B, yes, eh, eh, fa, Ker Fatu. He did speak to Solo Sunday. He did speak to him. And it's true. When he called Solo Sunday, Solo was at Bamboo at the time. Solo Sunday was there because this matter was supposed to be in the morning. And again, the reason why those of you many a history law, me and Nakuani later. Told me we were in for it. Our relatives went there. We asked them to go there. We encouraged them to be a part of it. One of my brothers, Mimfamo BJ, Ablai Jite. A lot of you Ali Alone. Ablai. Abijele. Now we were in contact with BJ. Lamin Tunkara Doma. Adoma lu Ibrahim anyol Ismail anyolu Bakar anyolu Baby je lamin tunkara doma sabale bije. Ndola broda buba jite was there. Ngamera li alone. Nali a video jibe. La speaker katarate la bulu Westfield abe diamula. Buba jite. Nkoto malo. We were all in contact. Solo. Dolbe diaspora ya mini alonko they promise that they have groups, this group, this group, this, that, this, that, you know, ekoi, they will join. They never join. Solo was there, they were waiting for orders to arrive. It was then that as Dabo said, he called Solo Sunday. Because IEC people were supposed to go to bureaus to inspect. And this Solo Sunday told people that it might be late because people, IEC is expected to visit some bureaus. What I am telling you, I'm aware. But Dabo is not telling things that he is supposed to say. Because today, Solo Sunday is a hero, he's not alive. Today, Solo Sanden is a hero. He is not alive. But wallahi, I believe he would even have had an issue with Dabo. Because of the way Dabo has treated Solo Sanden's accomplices. Solo Sanden, the people that sat on the table. Ining Solo Inim Plano draw. Those that sat on the table to draw this plan with Solo. The way Dabo is treating them, the way he treated them, I am afraid if Solo were alive, he would have treated him the same way. He died. May Allah's forgiveness be upon him. 
when he called solo sande akai ko ebe muntole tonya i mean for kerfadu solo where are you solo kai ko mbe bambo akai ko what are you doing there imanta ai sing call bina e ko biro soronda yes au for solo le bara danta dame amanya nat amanda woto de ako he and then you know he felt ko solo there was something he didn't say dabo manda woto Dabo continued because solo accepted solo ko buba jita nyole ko anin dolu minu bije alimbatu mbero slangata biroto purnying ai simon barimbina solo left when he left when he was returning i ain't a call he called i am one of those he talked in fact ndela nga call and lamin tungara equally because we were, it was a tense situation we expected call electoral reform new for that a lot of people should have come out to to fight about electoral reform and all of that but why didn't all of these people come out and of course people are aware udp mo jamale akala mutaje kmc la you fenge coordinator lu you know west coast region coordinators moli akala mutale but me ati na mo jamal man fundi usenu dabo is aware of this matter he knew that there was going to be a demonstration. Solonyo la demonstration no. Wola he kole ata he knew about it. I alone na akada tige. This was earlier. Bari Solo was confident because diaspora mole mole bijamini alone ko e fengol fai. Nka lente dolto vola. Bari mole be jibe roke kande. Nka mimfo. Banka mane alone. Nka mimfo. Onkul sidi sane alone. Nka mimfo. I mean, there are a lot of them that knew what I'm saying. Because Solo Sandeng was so, you know, optimistic because he kind of we have groups. We have a lot of groups. Ni UDP man na mbinale. Molbe fintilal. And Solo was very genuine about what was going to happen. Billahi nga kuma lefalete. When he was going back, we were all tensed. Nga kuma ndi mostly in tani ntungara na kebalom. We will talk all the time. Solo yon kumandi, nga solo kumandi, honorable solo, nga yon kato ke benyadi, nga al benyada, kwa nyo hun, mbota na njanal de, bari, ke ba ma yon kumandi ro kele. Yalon telfuno lel mu. So we make sure ko, nga kuol fenge inewe mi alon ko, ni ka tapi kana kalamda, because there was intelligence all the time, jame was also not stupid. Nga yon ako ha, ako, ako nga na ala politiko tinya, Dabo buka dame mfo wole Ako, 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 ako Solo sandele ko I mean regret Ako afale ko Naidi amoke There are things I regretted Amami mfalye Ako solo ele ko Kana na politiko tinya Itele ben na politiko tinya ala solo Itele ben na politiko tinya Sinya sabala ya fai Solo te keri mbi Bar ni mbebe nda al kiyama Bari solo te fani ya fola Dabo trusted solo he knows what Solo was capable of doing and how genuine Solo Sunday was. I'm not in this to get anything. And I'm not saying this to achieve anything. But we have to be factual. Billahi. Wallahi talai. Nyinong kumati dabo yi mfai. Adunte da mate de. La min tunkara bije mwoli bije mini alon ko. Solo ya fo ko. Alza la kilo tu nak. Mbese ya kilo tu nyoto. Adu mbese nyo muta fanang. Because this is saying... Talam koma tu tige Dabole yo fo solo Akaye ko itele benna parti yo tinyala Itele benna politiko tinyala Kanan na politiko tinyala Dabole wole regret abuka fo molye Wallahi ya wole regret Nga kala mutale Ye wole regret Solo told people I mean to trust Ite dabole itele hafai Adung there are people double coming ko alkana ma beje wala tina udp mo jama ni on ding there were a lot of boys muna na alaji dabo ma ma be he knew about it brikama honorable alaji s dabo he was aware he was part of this he knew everything why didn't he appear mp brikama not wala brikama not alma nyininka alaji dabo why didn't he go alaji dabo fatia mimbeola na kebalo mga alone he was in this fatia mimbala jarinte ya mimbala why didn't he go to demonstrate for electoral reform 
Why didn't the people like 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 you know KM Sila mobilize us all muna ne manta? Udesi senyol baby jele bi i baby balurin i baby je buba jite be balurin farma da jawara bi je i baby balurin noko enjanyol bi je so useni mi regret he was never in support of what Solo was doing. 